In a moment, we'll begin our English presentation. But first, a word from the Catholic Church. Habemos Papam Ratzinger! I am but a humble servant in the vineyard of the Lord. Well, it's not every day that we fictional characters get to spend some good quality time together like this. Uh, what's been going on lately? Polonius, how about you start us off? You, Hamlet, have asked me, Polonius, a question, and I, Polonius, shall answer that question in the presence of St. Joan, Merlin, Marlowe, and of course, Hamlet. I will now answer your question of what I've been doing. I will not hesitate to answer your question of what I've been doing. And when I say I will answer your question of what I've been doing, I mean that I, Polonius, will answer your question of what I've been doing in the presence of St. John, Merlin, Marlowe, and of course, Hamlet. And now to answer in the presence of... SHUT UP, POLONIUS! JUST SHUT THE HELL UP! DAMN IT! I COME FROM THE FUTURE! I SPEAK FROM EXPERIENCE WHEN I SAY THAT YOU NEVER SHUT UP! Ah! JUST SHUT UP! I'm upset. Just stop talking. I'm a saint, and I can't stand you. Silence is a virtue. Why are the lights off? Where's the light switch? Ow! Stop with the poking! Loud noises! Loud noises! People tripping! Ow! My People God. screaming! Ow! Loud noises! Screaming! 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 Ow! Loud noises! Oh my God! Calm down! Calm down, everybody! <sighs> Marlo, you still with us? All right. Merlin? Yo! Hamlet? Stop touching my mother! Fair enough! Polonius? Polonius? Shit! Where's Polonius? Wait, I got the lights. Where's Polonius? Oh dear. Now one murder, that was acceptable, but two, this has just gotten out of hand. Well actually it's still only one murder. Okonko committed suicide. It's ridiculous, Okonko wouldn't commit suicide. He'd never get into heaven. Actually, we're very selective, he wouldn't have gotten in anyway. Yeah, what with his cowrie shells, other gods, and fatal obsession with yams. <laughs> Okonko was not walking the well-lit path of salvation. Not again! Not St. Joan! Why? Why? Has this ever happened to you? Being burned alive has become a far too common problem for people over the age of 30. You may be surprised to learn that most insurance doesn't cover being burned alive, and especially not at the stake. Funeral costs often exceed $5,000. But really, what is there to bury? But now, peace of mind. From the same people who brought you Indian rate insurance comes the aptly named Gone with the Wind plan. For only $3 a day, you can pay to send my kid to college. But more importantly, you'll be prepared for the worst. Offers not available to smokers, Texans, and those deemed technically muted by the church. Also, offer void in England, France, Germany, North Korea. We do not accept Chinese credit cards or Japanese money. Thank you. What's going on around here? From my count, it seems the two people have not been killed. Three people. Three people! Three people! Three people have been killed, there's only three of us left. Is anyone else coming to this thing? Ah, I think Prince John is coming. Mm. Mm. Hey, Prince John! 
Thou art no longer, no longer thou art. What? I killed you. Why did you say that? I stabbed you through the heart. I thought you'd notice. Didn't hurt. You stabbed like a girl. <laughs> Him! What the hell? That? That was just spur of the moment. But the other people, I didn't kill them. I swear. I'm not crazy. You need to see a shrink. Don't worry, Hamlet. I'm here to help. Henry Kissinger? What? No, I am not Henry Kissinger. I am Dr. Siegmund Freud. Bring a psychiatrist! Now, what seems to be the trouble? <laughs> well, <laughs> Dr. Freud, I just get these uncontrolled urges to kill people! Hmm. I see. Well, we'll get to the bottom of this. Your uncontrollable psychotic urges could come from something in your past. Why don't you start from the beginning? Well, I'm just a poor boy. Nobody loves me. He's just a poor boy from a poor family, sparing his life on these monstrosities. <laughs> easy come, easy go, will you let me go? Priscilla, no, we will not let you go. Let him go! Priscilla, we will not let you go. Let him go! Priscilla, we will not let you go. Let me go! We will not let you go. Let me go! We will not let you go. Let me go. No, no. No, 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 mamma mia, mamma mia, mamma mia, let me go. The housing room has a devil of all inside for me, for me, for me. keeps turning up these lights it's really freaking me out it was unlit well dim very dim gloomy very gloomy not bright not bright at all you could even say it was dark dark very dark in the darkness the darkness consumed me very dark indeed so dark that you could cut the darkness with a dark knife and it would bleed, it would darkly bleed dark blood, forming a dark pool of dark blood. And said pool would stain the darkness, and the darkness would only be restored by dark peroxide. Dark. A little too dark. If I didn't know any better, I'd think that the author was using chiaroscuro. Oh, chiaroscuro. The darkness. Chiaroscuro. Oh, Chiaroscuro. Chiaroscuro. Oh, Chiaroscuro. Right here in River City. Right here in River City. The horror, the horror. Wow, that was really cool. Oh my god! Why did you do that? Who keeps incessantly stabbing me with this knife? Ah! Am I, is that you? Ah, ah! Guess not. Hey, is that a poison knife you're using? Oh yeah, that's awesome. That's awesome. Who killed us and... Who turned on the lights? So it was like... me, Colonel Mustard, in this study with a knife. A very big knife. I am but a humble servant in the vineyard of the Lord. Number one! You shouldn't have rolled down the, the hill, you <laughs> idiot! There's deer shit on that hill! Oh my god, I'm so wet! Prop this in the movie where? Ah, probably the bloopers. 
Ah, the blooper reel and a crash. <laughs> <laughs> Hope we get a good deer or something here. Try to chill out with the camera, okay, and the light switch and the yes. <laughs> oh my god! Hamlet, is that you? Wait, uh, what? what? The door! Uh, what? The light! Your first line is why did you do that? Oh. <laughs> and the smoke detector? Oh. Yeah. Ow. <laughs> Steve, you gotta be careful where you're walking. Shut up, it's dark. <laughs> Steve's as blind as a man. <laughs> Ow. Maybe you need those glasses after all. <laughs> Shut up! I'm uh, Mike, turn it off. You got all I'm a saint, and I can't stand you. Silence is a virtue. Oh, 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 oh. I miss you, my friend, for a song. Oh, oh, oh. I want to take a song. Oh, oh. I drink wine, and I'm cowardly. Oh, oh, oh. I sound like Pepe Le Pew, or oh, that Canadian lumberjack from the Bugs Bunny cartoons. Oh, 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 Kissinger, I am Dr. Siegmund Freud. Famous psychiatrist! 